Hello, my name is Stacy Vincent. I'm the Assistant Professor of Agricultural Education at the University of Kentucky and the Superintendent of the Agricultural Issues Career Development Event. The Career Development Event consists of a wide variety of events, but primarily two major components. One would happen to be your portfolio. The portfolio is going to consist of the research that you have done as a team. You're going to be able to compose of a two-page summary of the, of the agricultural issue. You're going to have a section that, with all of your citations, and then you're going to go out into the public and present your, your findings. And based upon all those presentations, we want another uh, set of pages of documentation of those forums. And then comes the best part, the presentations. The forums themselves actually become the contest. You get the opportunity to have your forum as it is in your community, except now in the competition role. The skills that an FFA member possess in this career development event uh, is an abundant. In fact, I can come up with a plethora of them. In fact, I had to write them on a sheet of paper for you guys. I categorize them into three major areas. The obvious, all right? You're gonna go in, you're gonna gain some public speaking skills, team building skills, leadership, but then we start going into the relevant skills that I classify in category number two. And those relevant skills are gaining that advocacy uh, component. Being able to, uh, what I notice among our FFA members is that they take on this, this skill set and this act of selflessness, which is amazing. And then patience, whoa, that's a skill set? Absolutely, in fact, Fortune 500 companies are, are looking for that category, category among their employers. Someone who can possess the skills of patience. And then acceptance. You have to be willing to accept that people on your team think differently than you. They look at things from a different side. And you have to be willing to accept what they're going with. And the last skill set, or the category that I recognize, is marketability. What makes you a marketable individual? And from, and from our component, those skill sets are you're very global-minded. These interpretation skills, being able to take the law and and be able to understand it just as much as anyone else in your state. In fact, as a former high school ag teacher, I, I would tell my students, you guys know this issue better than anyone else in our state. That is a very, very big responsibility. But it's because you interpret all sides of the issue. And last but not least, these rationalization skills, that you're able to rationalize the difference between fact and fiction. There's no, more, there's no time to just say, well, that's what mama said. You have to back it up with facts and support it with, with the truth. And that's the opportunity of rationalization skills. And that leads into what does that help you with? And for our, for our area, it's an abundance. As a former high school ag teacher, I noticed that our students are in law school now, that, they, that they're teachers, that they're extension agents, they're working for international relations because of the skill sets that they gained in this career development event. So if you're looking for things such as to become a lobbyist, if you're looking for opportunities to go into law, if you're, if you're thinking about having an international relation and being able to work in human resources, this is the career development event for you.